Welcome everyone, I'm Martin Tyler, he's Alan Smith, and we're going to talk about this match today from the commentary position. Hi there, Martin. Yeah, and expecting big things here, there's a great atmosphere. In Fridge Town now against Reading. Reading. They've got a decent result in their last game, it was away from home, and they drew against Bolton Wanderers. Yeah, and a bit fortunate to, to draw the match 1-1. Uh, I've just got a hunch that this one will go the other way. I think they're going to lose. Number five, Tommy Smith. Number six, Adam Lester. One of the great clubs of the 1950s in the English game. Wolverhampton Wanderers actually set the standards then. At the moment, they're struggling to meet the standards of the second tier of English football. And this could be a, a season of real struggle for the once famous Wolves. Well, I had them down as title challengers. I can't believe where they are at this stage in the season and I just don't think they're going to recover now. Ipswich out, the shot's on! The goalkeeper plunged to make the save. And Reading have got a corner here. And here comes the corner. Cleared away, well away from goal. Kelly. And now the shot! The assistant has raised the flag for offside. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. So it's the big day for the manager. A competitive match with his new team. Yeah, he's, he's better to be nervous, isn't he? Because you want to get off to a good start. Got the tackle in. Swift. Now it's offside, and it looks as though they might be in to score. It's good play until they got that challenge in. And that, for sure, is a goal kick. Such an important position in the modern game, uh, at full-back, and they've strengthened, haven't they, with this signing? Yeah, and I think you're always looking for athleticism when you're looking at your full-backs, and... This is a player that can get up and down all day. Well, this attack... Oh, chance! Right from the kickoff. They look like scoring they have now. Sharp from the off, and what a good goal. was a top-class goal. Well, it was a great delivery into the box from that left-hand side. It's where they look dangerous. Well, here is the goal, and the ball in, the supply line, was superb. Yeah, just really good timing of the ball in and the movement inside the box. Sticks out a leg, and that was enough. Attacking well here. He's reached up and turned it over. And this will be a corner for Reading. <laughs> Defended well. Swift. Well, he tried his luck from a long way out, but the goalkeeper had no problems at all. Made sure the ball is stuck at his foot. A return ball. Good work, really, to read the intention of the pass. It goes out wide again, and they get it away. Oh, he's cut that out well, well read. This could lead to a chance. It's good attacking play. Well, the away team come here having drawn their last two games, which shows a competitive streak but maybe not quite the winning mentality that they need no but you wonder whether a draw here would be satisfactory whether they take that now on the move and able to cut out the pass there's good progress with this attack shots on here and that's a corner for Reading Disappointed that that didn't lead to more. Now 
No need to stop the play there because they've got the ball and they can use the advantage. And there's the interception. Drills it in. And that's the goal that's brought them level. It's Reading who've broken through in that attack. Well, he's got a track record of that. On his left side, he's so dangerous. Oh, well, he's just wanted that more than his opposite number. It's a really good finish. It is uh, level. Both sides have scored here now. John Swift. It's Webster. And a special occasion for him. Concentrating there on the match on his birthday. Swift. Played forward, a bit of menace in this attack. Anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene. Strong, fair challenge, pulls out for a throw though. Gleason. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. Attacking team not happy about that offside call, but we can see it again here. Well, he is quick, this lad, and he can afford to give himself another yard. I think he's got the beating of these defenders in a race. And now the shot! And the goalkeeper got across to it. Corner kick given. Swung in from the corner. Cleared away by the defender. And here's the shot. What a save. Another corner. Corner's taken. Cleared away, well away from goal. And that will be a throw. Thiago Ilori. been judged by the officials as sides look clear enough now Kelly could be dangerous trying to slip it through good idea to play in behind there but the goalkeeper read it and swept up He's on the move all the time and makes lots of these interceptions. That looked very good indeed, but the move has broken down. Gleason. And here they are on the attack. Got to clear it now. The fourth <laughs> official has indicated three more minutes. Three minutes of added time. Quick-witted and quick in his movement, too, to intercept there. It's a free kick against Reading here. Swift. Promising build-up until that challenge. So here we are at half-time, and it... Everything set for the second half. Luke Chambers on the attack here. Shots on! No difficulty for the goalkeeper, Manone. They've cut it out. Gleason. Oh, he's cut that out well, well read. Ah, full extent. 
action, the goalkeeper makes the save. And it's back for another corner. In goes the corner. Only partially cleared, so there's still some problems for them. That's a wonderful tackle. I wish we could add to the speculation that's going on about this potential transfer, but it's still in the realms of potential. We can't tell you it's been done yet. Well, all the fans are excited about it, Martin, and I bet the player is as well. I bet uh, he's desperate for the move to go through. Good position. They've worked this attack very well into a quite a dangerous position now. Well, that is another corner. I think the coach will be considering his options on the bench. Corner swung in. Defended well. Now, this looks promising. Well, I don't know who the lad saw there passing the ball. Somebody in the crowd, maybe. Great defending there, stopping that attack. Could be a chance here. They've got the ball into a good area. Makes a challenge here. And well, that's good support as they build this attack. Thiago Ilori. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. Benitez. Into the attacking third. Gleason. Moving the opposition around with their play, these two players. Poor attempt at a pass, really. That's a brilliant piece of intercepting there at a crucial time in a crucial position. Getting forward well as a team now. That's good support play from his teammates. Reading's next game, Alan. They're playing Derby County in their next match in the championship. And I think in behind the defenders. Delivery to the far post. And that'll be a throw. I think the uh, manager's decided he wants to let the player have a great individual reception, which he wouldn't get at the final whistle. He's uh, getting an ovation now as the substitution is made. Yeah, and well deserved to. A strong contender for man of the match. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. And that will be a throw. And that's broken up by the defender before the cross could come in. That's very good shit. Well, we've got a free kick here. And referee points for it. We are going to see... A substitution now. And now the shot! The defenders managed to get in the way there. Challenges for the ball. Neatly intercepted.
Goalkeeper hangs on. Well, we're playing mind games here as well as the actual game of football. Are they prepared to risk losing to try and win? We're going to find out. It's still level pegging in the closing moments. In comes the challenge. Now Morris. He's gone in strongly and got the ball. A chance to break away now on the counter. It's Webster. He's on the move all the time and makes lots of these interceptions. Here's a chance. It's a great moment for the scorer, a great moment for his team. He's put them in front. Well, the best players step up at the vital moments, and he's done that there. It's hardly going to be time to restart this with the lateness of the goal. Perfect timing, that one. So that goal means Reading are trailing. They've got the ball back by that interception. It's been a thrilling contest, this, and we're into the last knockings of it. And the supporters, well, they're not showing any sign of losing their stamina. But... Oh, chance! Webster! What a brilliant goal! Well, they've extended their lead in this game. And the gap between these two sides is reflected now on the scoreline. Brilliant play here by a terrific team that have got two quick goals. Well, they're right on top of the game, unstoppable at the moment, and they'll be hoping for another. 3-1 the scoreline as we restart the game. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looked very encouraging. Two more minutes to be played then, added time. Just read the intentions of the opposition there. This is how they love to play on the break, and he's flagged offside. Thiago Ilori played in on the goalkeeper. In with a chance. Well, there's a twist of the tail here. They've cut the deficit in half. They're only one behind now. There's still plenty of time to try and find this equaliser. They want to get back for the kickoff because they have got this goal. Now they're just one down, but time is really ticking on. I thought they were right on the feet there, Martin, but a goal at them. And that is the end. It's all. Well, this attack. Our oh, chance. There's the interception. Drills it in. And that's the goal that's brought them level. English Football League Championship. Aston Villa 1, Queen's Park Rangers 2, Brentford 0. Millwall, 1. Bristol City, 1. Preston North End, 2. Derby County, 1. Cardiff City, 2. Fulham, 2. Leeds United, 1. Ipswich Town, 3. Reading, 2. Middlesbrough, 3. Bolton Wanderers, 1. Nottingham Forest, 1. Huddersfield Town, 1. Oxford United, 2. Sunderland, 1. Sheffield United 1, Hull City 0. Sheffield Wednesday 0, Birmingham City 2. Wigan Athletic 1, Wolverhampton Wanderers 1. Now let's see what effect that's had on the league standings. At the top of the table, we have new leaders in Birmingham City with 48 points. In second, the former leaders, Huddersfield Town with 46 points. In third, rising up the table are Fulham with 42 points. In fourth, moving down, are Bristol City with 41 points. In fifth, climbing the table, are Wolverhampton Wanderers with 40 points.
In sixth and falling are Sheffield Wednesday with 40 points, but only behind on goal difference. In seventh, moving down, are Derby County with 40 points, but only behind on goal difference. In eighth, Ipswich Town with 39 points. Bottom of the table and falling are Hull City with 20 points, but only behind on goal difference. And then reading up the table, second bottom rising up the table are Wigan Athletic with 20 points. Third bottom, Sheffield United with 24 points, but only behind on goal difference. Fourth bottom, Oxford United with 24 points. Fifth bottom, Millwall with 25 points, but only behind on goal difference.
Hi there again, everybody. I'm Martin Tyler, and Alan Smith with me for this championship game. Yeah, well, Martin, really pleased to be here. The match today, it's Reading against Derby County. Reading looking for some reaction after that away loss in their last game against Ipswich Town. Yeah, I mean, they might think it could have turned out a bit better than that 3-2 defeat. But I don't think it's going to turn out much better here. I think they're going to lose again. I don't think there's any doubt now that we're going to have a, a fight to the finish here. A really exciting end to the season. I think any neutral loves to see it. I mean, it's nerve shredding for the teams involved. You can't make a mistake at this stage because it might just cost you dearly. Reading are ready to go with this lineup. Vito Manoni starts in goal. Liam Moore starts. He's back from suspension today, and they'll play with a sole striker. Quite a few changes for Derby. Andre Wisdom starts. He's back from suspension. George Thorne starts, looking to recover his form. In attack, Cameron Jerome starts, replacing Chris Martin, who's been out of sorts lately. Just lent the ball to his mate and got it back again. Neatly intercepted. Pressed high here. Clement. Could be dangerous. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. Well, we've got an angle on this uh, offside call. Alan, I must say, it is the most difficult thing in all the officiating, I think. But this assistant has got eagle eyes. Well, I certainly wouldn't want to do that job because uh, the uh, speed that players move now, as it turns out, what a great call. Giroud. Lawrence. Clement. Well, well read. Roy Behrens. Really getting at the opposition this far up the pitch now. Cleared away by the defender. Joe Ledley. It's good play until they got that challenge in. It's a good cross. It's a crossbar. And they get it away. Joe Ledley. The cross is blocked there by the defender. Promising build-up until that challenge. Good anticipation by the opposing player there to read the direction of the throw. Giroud. Shots on here. Well, it looks a bad miss, but I think the defender just put him off. Yeah, he's got to take a lot of credit for that because uh, he had to take the shot quickly, the lad who was trying to score. Well, I like the look of this attack. We're going to get a corner here because of that deflection. Corner played into the middle. Chooses to punch here, the goalkeeper. Good technique. Oh, that's good defending. And now he's looking for some support. Thor. And that'll be a corner. Put the corner in the middle. No difficulty for the goalkeeper, Manone. On the attack here. That's an easy piece of goalkeeping. Stopped emphatically and just as well. The approach play looked very encouraging. Trying to switch on the 
attacking power in this situation. Good punch from the goalkeeper from the cross. Cutting in now. Looking to make an opportunity either for... Jerome! That's a good goal for them! And they have been playing well. No one can really complain about them taking the lead here. They have been much the better side. And it's a fine piece of finishing. They've come out here to put on a show, and we're enjoying it. Everybody except the opposition is enjoying this. It's not often when you are allowed to create this many chances, so why not? They'll keep on pushing, I'm sure. It goes out wide again. So the first goal. Free kick given by the ref. Yellow from the ref. Oh, without question. Punched away by the goalkeeper. Guided on by his head. And they've got the ball still. Got to be. Corner kick given. He's put in the corner, cleared away by the defender. Break quickly when they get possession. Oh, the counter-attack was on, and it's come to nothing. Very good distance to the clearance. Striding for... He's got his shot off now. That's an easy save for the keeper. Thor. Well, they're in a good position here. Trying to pick out someone in the centre. And that's the way to defend. Make sure the opposition can't get on the ball in that part of the pitch. Well, here comes the support. Andre Wisdom. Well, that's into the gloves of the goalkeeper. Not the hardest thing he'll have to do today by any means. Well, they could pose some danger now. That looked very good indeed, but the move has broken down. Now Wisdom. It's good to know how much longer there is. This wasn't always the case, certainly when I started commentating. We've got two added minutes. Keo. Now this looks promising. Shots on here. Well, he scored. And it's a big moment for them in the match. They've pushed their lead now to two ahead. They've played well to this point. But sometimes a two-goal lead can be a dangerous one. We'll see. Well, scoring in any game is worthy of celebration. When you get two, it is special. And he is feeling that special delight at the moment. Restarting at 2-0. And the goalkeeper turns it over. Referee's given a corner. Corner played into the middle. Not really away from the threat here.
Well, this is the uh, second half now, and it's underway. It's looking good, this move. And shoots! Free kick given by the referee. And the defending team might be in trouble. They might regret conceding this. Barrett. Promising build-up until that challenge. Attacking well here. Going forward well. It could be a chance. And a goal. Well, how long's it been on? One or two minutes, I'm not sure, but he's marked his appearance here with a wonderful goal. Oh, what an important moment this might turn out to be as they strive for a comeback here. Yeah, they look down and out for a time there, but you can see the belief coursing through the veins of those players now. And we restart the game 2-1. Just read the intentions of the opposition there to make the interception. Attacking now. Lawrence. Joe Ledley. Just a case of finding the spare man is always available in their own half and the opposition letting them do this at the moment, although they are trailing. Giroud. Played forward, a bit of menace in this attack. Lawrence. Anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene. He might be through. And here's the shot. Now he's taken it off his toes and hung on to it. Yeah, no knockdowns there for any lurking strikers. Good goalkeeping. Able to cut that out with um, some sharp movement. Trying to switch on the attacking power in this situation. Throw in now. Well, this is where substitutes are important. Who and when. Definitely a throw in there. Now Wisdom. Thor. Well, it's the talk of the town, Alan, isn't it? This potential big money signing. Wouldn't it just? I mean, the rumours have been swirling for quite some time. Let's wait and see if there's any substance to them. Now they've got a chance in this part of the pitch. Excellent work with the tackle. Stephen Quinn. Aluko. Now Morris. Space to try and hit it now. Oh, it's a tremendous goal. Well, this team just won't lie down, will they? I thought they were down and out, two behind, but back on level terms. Great scenes of jubilation here, having got that equaliser, had to work so hard to achieve it. So it's 2-2 now. Butterfield. Keo. Jerome. Well, they're in a good position here. Just making sure, guiding it through. Lawrence makes a challenge here. Will not be tolerated in the stadium. Thank you. Andre Wisdom. Butterfield. Into the attacking third. Thor. A real chance here. Oh, saved by the goalkeeper at full stretch. Well, I'll admit. It is the substitution now. Yeah, played really well. Two 
brilliantly taking goals actually and he'll be hoping from the substitutes bench that his team can go on and win this good defensive clearance there Thor now they're looking to get forward from this position Butterfield It was a real opportunity, but there might be a key moment in there from a defensive point of view. Yeah, well, they really did converge on him quickly. He didn't miss by much, but he's missed it. So what about Derby County's next game? They're playing Sheffield Wednesday in their next match in the FA Cup, and, uh, and uh, not much at all to split the two sides for me. Pierce, nice bit of interplay between these two. That's good movement forward here. I think he saw the look from the other player and saw where the pass was going and read it. Anticipated the direction of the pass and was able to intervene. Butterfield. Oh, it's a corner via that deflection. He's put in the corner. And it's Reading now who are pressing and trying to get their noses in front. Thor. Andre Wisdom. Well, they could pose some danger now. Just moving the opposition around, maybe trying to wear them out by getting them to chase. Aluko. Well, this could be dangerous in a wide position. Trying to pick out someone in the center. Butterfield. Andre Wisdom. Now this looks promising. The fourth official has indicated... Referee has chosen to add on two, two extra minutes. Time. Butterfield. Shot off! Good stop by the goalkeeper. Final whistle. And it's finished level. It's good play until... English Football League Championship. Birmingham City 1, Fulham 1. Bolton Wanderers 2, Bristol City 2. Huddersfield Town 0.